Hey man, welcome to day 21. Today we're talking about uh, being slow to speak and quick to listen. Uh, James 1.19 says exactly that. Be slow to speak, quick to listen, and slow to get angry. And this is becoming more and more important as we, um, you know, in this in this society of, uh, you know, we're quick to, to rush to judgment in a lot of things. And men of wisdom don't do that. Men of wisdom uh, are willing to wait for the facts, of, are willing to wait until the full story comes out to be able to address it and to be able to speak with truth and and um, and reason. Uh, Proverbs is full of this. Proverbs is full of uh, verses that talk about, you know, not speaking out of turn and holding your tongue and, and uh, gaining knowledge. Uh, Proverbs 17.27 is it says, Whoever restrains his words has knowledge, and uh, he who has a cool spirit is a man of understanding. Um, the reality is that we're gonna, there's going to be a time to speak out for sure. It's not that we don't ever speak out, uh, but it's knowing when and how to do that. Proverbs 26.4 and 5 says, uh, Answer not a fool according to his folly, lest uh, you become like him. Answer a fool according to his folly, uh, or else he will be wise in his own eyes. What that's saying is that we need to have wisdom to know with the difference between in, in this situation whether we should address somebody who's speaking out of turn and and speaking kind of foolishly, um, or or just or not address it. And this is this takes wisdom. It takes um, us walking with the spirit and and but speaking at truth out of love as well, and not inciting this situation, inciting the the fact. And um, again, this is so easy on on uh, social media to do this. So um, I just encourage you, and it's challenge. You know, I'm as much of a you know, in need of this, you know, continuing to understand and learn this and, and hold my tongue as well. Uh, so my challenge is for all of us to go through Proverbs as we're spending time in the Word and gain this wisdom and, and really be willing to, to, to pray about before we react and uh, speak out um, into a situation. So hope you guys have a good day. See you tomorrow.